of light is closing in. All we can do is accept. This really is the end of us. We should take solace. Good fortune in the wilds, and look out for machines. I could have hit it with acid.
cravings. Is he filling up the canisters on the box? If I don't get Gaia up and running, it'll be like this everywhere. Just woke up, didn't you? <laughs> don't need a machine. Good luck in the field. are true. You must be the soldier who took down Regala's champion, and the one who's got this place in an uproar. What's a Tanakh doing in Plainsong? Resupplying for a trip to the hunting grounds. You should come by, it's just northwest of here. And a sturdy soldier like yourself could handle the trials there. But I could. Maybe I'll see you there.
going to... I prefer the sound of machines to singing. It is as soon as I get my... Supplies, I'm heading back to the hunting grounds. A brighter day! She's smooth. Wind carry. <laughs> A word of warning? Avoid the ruins northwest of Plainsong. Scouts say something lights up the ruins when night comes. Whatever it is, it's not natural. Good to know. Something lighting up the ruins. Could be old world tech. Might be worth taking a look. Amazing. I'm here, as promised. But singing. Does it mean the chorus is ready? It is assembled. I couldn't have done it without Varl. But I don't know what good it will do. The chorus is in disharmony. And the subject of the cave is bad enough. Land God Fa still hasn't emerged, and every day more deadly machines try to force their way out, throwing themselves against the defensive cordon we set up around the entrance. That is only the first of Many false notes. Your request has exposed deep divisions within the chorus itself. And the tribe. Ray and other machines like her, you call them the gods? Land gods, yes. For generations, they provided for us. Seeding and harvesting the fields of Plainsong. Food for all. A miracle of endless bounty. A farm run by machines. More than a farm. A blessed land providing sustenance for my people until the derangement. So, the chorus is assembled. What now? They're considering your request. Then... Shouldn't we go talk to them? When you're ready. But don't worry. Their debate won't end anytime soon. Meetings like these can go on for days. <sighs> All right. Then maybe I should resupply first. Who knows how many machines are in that cave? Assuming the chorus agree to allow you inside. Aloy can be pretty convincing in these situations. We'll see. Do what you need to prepare. We'll wait for you above where the chorus is gathered.
Game pieces. They look like machines. I don't teach newcomers. Please find someone else. Guess I'm not playing then. I could always go to Chain Scrape. I bet the Osram can teach me the game. I couldn't keep my hands out of the soil as is my way. There's metal. Going down. Aloy, I wanted to thank you again for saving my life out there. I know we don't have much, but I promise my rations will help keep your strength up in the wilds. I hope you know there'll always be a warm meal waiting for you here, Aloy. Thank you, Dane. Aloy, wasn't sure you'd ever come around. What do you think of Plainsong? It's quite a place. <laughs> sure. As long as you like the smell of manure. Ah, don't mind me. I won't go wandering again, I promise. There are people who need me here. Some of the others the Eclipse took had it worse than me. A lot worse. Do what you can for them, Yef. I will. It won't be anything like you did, but I'll give it my best. Stick around to see how this pans out, but I doubt that Utara will make a decision anytime soon.
Keep some extra on hand. Stash this away for later.
gonna find any. You needed confidence, that will give it to you. Hunter to hunter, let's trade. Nature's...
bounty stitched into I the hope perfect webs. It'll be worth it, Zoe. You'll see. going. I guess that means the chorus is still in session. The people sing to soothe the chorus, to help them break their impasse. It wouldn't be necessary if they were in harmony. I'm not gonna have to sing back, am I? Of course not. The singing will stop when we present ourselves. Are you ready? All right, let's go talk to them. Your sacred cave. There's something inside I need. If I can get it, it so will. Help. And the Nora have spread word of your story. And what you want. We know of no spirit in the cave, only Fa, our land god, who entered the cave and did not return. The power of the land gods is broken. We are diminished. Tales of spirits will not help us. Nothing will. We weaken. We die. And become fertile ground for new life. This is the natural order. Wait. You're all just going to sit around? Until you become food for worms? Literally? So says the Outlander. Ignorant of our beliefs. Please, remember how she brought peace to Ray. Listen to her. We've heard such temerity from you before, Zoe. Let us not forget that you agitated for reckless war against the Kaja. At least she's trying to help. Ah, by inviting you to break our traditions? Should we change our ways to suit every impudent outsider who wanders into plain song? You should change your ways because your own lands are killing you. We have stood by and watched as our land gods waste away. You would have us do the same with our neighbors, our children. And this lone outlander can save us. Nonsense. A single seed matters little in the infinite cycle of growth and decay. An alarm. It's coming from the mountains. The machines must have broken through the cordon. Then we need to get down there. What about the chorus? If the cordon has fallen, there is nothing left to prevent us from going in the cave. The time for permission is over. Then off we go. This way! Out the gate and around! Fighting in the fields ahead. Right. These machines don't get run. I've seen these machines before. Two killers. 
They must have come from the cordon. The others will defend the place. We have to move. We need to see if we can do something about all of this. All right. So, yeah. machines. These machines are stronger, deadlier than normal. There's more than just machines I want to see my Out, Aloy. On your lead.
one. Now onto the cordon. Let's go. Right behind you. Almost there. So many machines broke through. What happened to the Gordon's defenders? They better be ready for anything. May the land gods forgive our trespass. What is that? A kind of wall. Made of... Up Follow here! Follow your lead, Aloy. Ready for anything, now? door. To understand what's going on in there, you're gonna need one of these. something very powerful somewhere beyond that door and it wants us dead follow my lead and be ready for anything to find the 
core of this place. There's so much metal. Who built this place? Machines. Not like any you've seen before. Machines are here. We have to take them out. Right behind you. being repaired too and the spirit you're after is in here Minerva? maybe but i have a feeling that's not another wall not going that way Places like these makes killing machines. It's called a Festus. Looks like those cables are blocking the way up. You two wait here. I'll find another path. Okay. Standing in this floor panel, have to be something. Just like parts of those pillars are different. Maybe if I shoot the gears, I can lock them into place. Make a path up. That did something. So close. Stay there. 
should be exposed now. are twisted around that node on the other side. I'll see if I can get to it. We'll wait here. Who 
is that? Hephaestus. It's taken over this whole place. Back to me. Get on, Matrix. Five. Looks like there's another node on the other side. Near that door. Go to your bed. How to get to that node on the other side? There's still no sign of fog. It's a big place. We'll keep looking.
still her god. I do not grieve for a god or a machine, but because I no longer know what to believe. Look, so if you want, you can go back home. Do I still have one? And if so, for how long? Can you really heal our lands? Save my people? Aloy, the core. My focus is showing holograms on it. They look like machines. Overrides. Knowledge on how to tame machines. And you can learn this? data here from machines I haven't scanned yet. Got what you need? Yes. Let's press on then. Doesn't sound good. Was that the spirit, Minerva? I, I don't think so. At least. Attention. All personnel must vacate the facility immediately. What exactly was this place? Seen anything like it before? Error. Unauthorized access. Initiating facility lockdown. Stay out. What's going on? Well, at least the emergency lights work. What just happened? Minerva's definitely here. And I think it's trying to keep us out. I'll scout ahead, see if there's a way to get us in. You sure we shouldn't come with you? Oh, well, yeah. Minerva could be dangerous. Let me make sure it's safe. Okay. 
We'll be right here if you need us. Hephaestus, Gaia. This is what will help heal Plain Song? It's hard to explain. I mean, I barely understand it, but yeah. Okay. That's what Aloy's been looking for I this whole time. I need to find where Minerva's hiding. I should look for a way to access the facility systems. Locked. in the center for. The nerve is shutting me out. Outside. I need to find a way back into the facility. Oh. Oh, close. If I can get Minerva to cooperate, I can merge it with Gaia. Finally bring her back. And we can start fixing the blight, the storms. And maybe she can help me figure out who those strangers in the proving lab were. Why did they have a clone of Elizabeth? Why did they want it back up? Pipes up there. Might lead me to a way back in. shaft. Okay, now I've got to find a way to plug into this place. <laughs> Looks like some kind of dome. Wonder what it's for.
Minerva, I need the console. Please. Access denied. It didn't used to be like this. Do you remember it? Anything? You were part of something bigger once. Something good. Gaia. That's right. She can live again. But only if you give her the chance. I can't reboot her without you. I cease. I think you'll disappear into her. Become part of her, like you used to be. Is it this speaks? Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Minerva. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master override activated. Restoring Minerva function to original code. Do you wish to initiate heuristic metrics? of my heuristic matrix will not be complete for several minutes more. In the meantime, I suggest you familiarize yourself with this facility. It is our best option for a base of operations, and you can make use of its equipment to improve your ability to override machines. Um, uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, that, that sounds good. Shall I grant access to your companions? They will be here shortly. Um... Okay, but... Don't overwhelm them, okay? They don't have a lot of experience with things like... Well... You. This time? No. This time she's real. Borrel? So? This is Gaia. Hello. Hi. Hi. Gaia's still, uh, waking up. Let's look around. I will highlight the location of the lab on your focus. Good. So what was this place? A regional control center, where Zero Dawn progeny would have overseen terraforming operations in the area. What's all this? This was intended as the main gathering space for control center operatives. You could fit a good number of people in here. Or maybe just a few, to start with. You two go ahead. I'm going to poke around a bit.
So this was supposed to be the lab. That was its intended purpose. Some of the machine data you recovered from the repair bay below us appears to be corrupted. Accessing the terminal in this room will show you how to repair and complete the override. I'll take a look. Well, I was able to repair some of the corrupted overrides. But it looks like I need data from more machine parts to fix the rest. My initialization is complete. You may continue to explore the facility, Aloy. When you are ready, return to the control room. Okay. Maybe it's time to talk to Gaia. I'll leave you to it. So you're... ready? Yes. Initialization is complete. All tests show that my heuristic matrix launched correctly and is stable. You must have many questions. Yeah. But two big ones first. Maybe you can help me make sense of something. A while ago, I had a run-in with a group of... Strangers, who tried to kill me. They had machine servitors, and a, um... Uh, a clone. Of Elizabeth Sobek with them. Yes, this was recorded by your focus. Do you know who they are? The answer to that question is related to the extinction signal that woke Hades, prompting my predecessor's self-destruction. The extinction signal? Okay, that sounds ominous. The signal did not come from Earth, Aloy. The calculations are complicated, but it appears to have originated 81 trillion kilometers away. Distance so vast that light itself requires 8.611 years to cross it. Okay, so what's so far away and, and why does it want us dead? The Sirius star system. Sirius? But that's where Far Zenith, their ship. The Odyssey. Yes, that's where it was headed. But it blew up. Unless... Uh, I don't... Why make it seem like they failed? They didn't want anyone to know. They didn't want future humans to think that... They were out there. Wait. The strangers who tried to kill me at the Hades Proving Lab? The ones with the clone? Are you saying that they're from... That they're descendants of... Far Zenith? Yes. That is my conclusion. We're not gonna be able to fix the biosphere without making you whole. I ran a search for your sub-functions at the Hades Proving Lab, but... Minerva was the only one I found. Thankfully, the sensory capabilities of this facility are far more advanced. 
I will search for the others now. Transmitting query pattern. Receiving. Of Apollo, Artemis, and Aluvia, I can find no trace. They are simply gone. What about the others? Ether, Demeter, and Poseidon are revealed. They lie within reach. Procurable. And Hephaestus? It too stands revealed, but it is not like the others. <laughs> That's for sure. In the years since the extinction signal, Hephaestus has evolved. Moreover, it is not confined to a single location. It haunts the global network that connects cauldrons to each other across the planet, making it exceptionally difficult to subdue. Let me guess. We need it bad? Correct. Its capabilities are essential. Without it, I can only delay the extinction of life on Earth. Hephaestus is our only hope of a permanent solution. So we start there? Unfortunately, we cannot. Procuring Hephaestus can only be attempted after my own capabilities have been significantly enhanced. Grab the other subordinate functions first, then Hephaestus. Precisely so. So, Aether, Demeter, and Poseidon. How do I capture them? To recover a subordinate function, you will have to travel to its location and find the physical processor to which it escaped. Then, exactly as you did with Minerva, you must use the Master Override to revert the subordinate function to its original code state. And then how do I get it back here? The subordinate function must be loaded onto a data storage device and physically carried back to this facility. The cartridge your root kernel was stored on? Yes. Its capacity is limited, so it can only carry one subordinate function at a time. But in all other respects, it will suffice. I guess I should get going and start bringing back subordinate functions. Yes. Once we have them, we can focus on the reacquisition of Hephaestus. When that is achieved, I will have complete control of the Zero Dawn system, and the ability to produce as many machines as needed to defeat the Far Zenith threat. An army of machines. Sounds like a plan. So, the three procurable subfunctions. What can you tell me about their locations? When my predecessor destroyed herself, the subordinate function sought physical processors capable of holding them. So in each case you will be looking for a powerful computer of some kind. Ether is the closest and therefore might be the easiest to acquire. However, it appears to be in the middle of Tanakh territory. My knowledge of that tribe is limited to data I read on your focus, but they seem to have a significant inclination towards violence. Well, that's a nice way to put it. What about Poseidon and Demeter? Poseidon has taken shelter in the desert south of this location. My substratal geography data indicates that a major old world settlement called Las Vegas was located there. A ruin in the middle of the desert, huh? Agreed. As for Demeter, it appears to be located on the coast to the far west. Unfortunately, I am unable to provide any relevant data about the region. As such, it may be the most difficult to retrieve. Okay, so three subordinate functions to go after. Aether, somewhere in Tanakh's territory, Poseidon in the desert, and Demeter on the coast. Where will you begin? I think I'll head for Aether. Then I will assign Aether as the objective on your focus. If you obtain it, I may be able to use it to quell the most severe storms in the region. 
Though I will require Hephaestus and the control over machines that it offers to permanently stabilize the biosphere. Should you change your mind, you can update your objective via your focus interface at any time. I will also transmit a summary of available data on all of the subordinate functions to you for reference. Is there anything else I can help you with? I know- I do, don't I? Is something wrong? Um... I don't know. It's just that... Elizabeth set the bar pretty high. She had a dream for you, for life on Earth, and... A lot has gone wrong, and do you think I can do it all? Repair the system? Defeat Varzenith? Live up to her example? Absolutely. In her last message, my predecessor declared her unwavering conviction in your success. In you, all things are possible. You prevailed in purging Hades and rebooting my system core. Thank you, Gaia. Well, I, uh, I guess I should get going. I have unlocked the facility's exits. The other leads back down the mountain to Plainsong, should you wish to return east. Varl? Whoa! Gonna have to get used to that. Uh, yeah. Gaia's opened the exits to this place. Can you and Zoe meet me by the west door? Be right there.